Have you ever stopped to wonder how artificial intelligence makes decisions? It's a question that we're going to delve into today. Artificial intelligence, or AI as we often call it, is a field of computer science that's all about creating machines that can think and learn like us humans. But how does AI actually make decisions? Well, at the heart of AI decision-making are algorithms. These are sets of rules or instructions that guide the AI's actions. They're like the recipe that guides the AI on how to process information and make decisions. Consider a simple AI system, like a chess-playing bot. To decide its next move, the bot uses an algorithm that takes into account the current state of the board, the possible moves it could make, and the likely responses from the opponent. The algorithm processes all this information, weighs the pros and cons of each move, and then decides on the best course of action. But here's where things get complex. AI systems don't just rely on one algorithm. They use a multitude of them, each with its own specific task. And these algorithms don't just process a handful of data points. They sift through vast amounts of data, everything from the previous moves in the game to the historical performance of the opponent. And it's not just chess. Whether it's a virtual assistant recommending a song, a self-driving car deciding when to brake, or a healthcare AI predicting a patient's recovery time, they all use complex algorithms and process tons of data to make informed decisions. But what makes these AI systems truly impressive is their ability to learn and adapt. They're not just blindly following a set of rules, they're constantly learning from the data they process, refining their algorithms, and improving their decision-making abilities over time. So in essence, AI algorithms draw from extensive data sets to make informed decisions. But can this process be biased? We'll dig into that in the next scene. Stay tuned. We often consider machines to be unbiased, but is that really the case with AI? It's a question that begs a deeper exploration. See, when we talk of bias in AI decision-making, we're wading into a complex territory where bias can slip in through various doors. One such door is the data. AI learns from data. And if the data it's fed is biased, the AI can mirror those biases in its decision-making. Imagine a facial recognition algorithm trained mostly on light-skinned faces. It's not a stretch to see how this could lead to racial bias, with the software struggling to accurately recognize darker-skinned faces. Similarly, if an AI is trained on data that reflects gender bias, it can propagate that bias. For instance, if an AI used in hiring is trained on a data set where the majority of successful candidates are male, it could unfairly disadvantage female candidates, assuming that male candidates are inherently more likely to succeed. But data isn't the only culprit. The algorithms themselves can also harbor bias. This is often unintentional and can be a result of the designer's unconscious biases, or it could come from oversights in the design process. This is often seen in AI systems that make predictions based on historical data. If the historical data is biased, the predictions will be too. Now let's not forget about real-world examples. There have been instances where facial recognition software misidentified individuals of certain ethnicities at a higher rate, or when AI used in predictive policing disproportionately targeted certain neighborhoods based on biased historical data. These examples illustrate that bias in AI is not a hypothetical issue. It's real. It's happening. And it can have significant consequences. It can perpetuate existing societal biases and even create new ones. It can lead to unfair outcomes and discrimination. Bias in AI is real and can have significant consequences. It's a sobering truth, but it's also a call to action, an invitation to scrutinize the data we feed our AI, to carefully consider the design of our algorithms, and to constantly check for biases. It begs the question, but what steps can we take to reduce it? And that's exactly what we'll dive into next. Can we truly eliminate bias from AI decision-making? This is a question that has sparked much debate in the field of artificial intelligence. While it might be challenging to completely eradicate bias, it is certainly possible to significantly reduce it. One major way of mitigating bias is by diversifying the data sets used to train AI. Just like a child learns from its environment, AI learns from the data it's fed. If the data is skewed, so will be the AI's decision-making. For instance, if an AI is trained solely on data from one demographic, it's likely to make biased decisions when dealing with other demographics. Therefore, using diverse data that accurately represents the world's population is crucial. Another noteworthy strategy is scrutinizing the algorithms themselves. Algorithms aren't born biased. They become biased when they're trained on biased data. So, scrutinizing the algorithms can help identify and correct any bias that may have crept in. Now let's talk about the elephant in the room, transparency. In the world of AI, 
Transparency isn't just about showing the public how decisions are made. It's about making the entire process understandable. From data collection to algorithm design and decision making, transparency allows us to see if there's any hidden bias in the process and provides an opportunity to correct it. But transparency alone isn't enough. We need accountability too. This means holding AI developers and users accountable for the decisions their AI systems make. If an AI system makes a biased decision, someone should be held responsible. Lastly, implementing strict regulations and standards can further help in mitigating bias. These regulations should be designed to ensure that AI systems are fair, transparent, and accountable. In conclusion, while it's challenging, it's not impossible to mitigate bias in AI. By diversifying data sets, scrutinizing algorithms, increasing transparency, holding people accountable, and implementing strict regulations, we can take significant strides towards reducing bias. While we can't completely eliminate bias from AI, we can take significant steps to reduce it. What does the future hold for AI decision-making? As we look ahead, it's clear that AI is only going to become more ingrained in our everyday lives. With this increased influence, the decisions made by these systems will have even greater impacts. The future of AI decision-making holds immense promise but it also presents challenges. Expect to see a growing focus on developing fair and unbiased AI. This means creating algorithms that make decisions without favoring one group over another. It also involves building systems that are transparent so we can understand how and why they make the decisions they do. However, achieving this won't be easy. It will require ongoing research, regulation, and perhaps most importantly, a commitment to ethical AI principles. We'll need to ensure that AI systems not only make effective decisions, but also decisions that are in line with our societal values. As we continue to advance in the field of AI, it is crucial that we strive for fairness and transparency in AI decision-making.